how to use bybit sub account what all can you do with that and how you can transfer funds from your main account to bybit sub account and vice versa and in this tutorial we'll cover everything that you need to know about bybit sub account but first of all what is bybit sub account well bybit offers a free feature to all of its user where you can create multiple sub accounts so to give you an example if you have a main account with your email and you want to create another bybit account well technically you can't do that but with the bybit sub account feature you can create at least 20 sub account now the beauty of this sub account is that you can use it yourself or you can give it to others to execute different trading strategies and this sub account sort of works like a full-fledged bybit account with limitation that you cannot withdraw the fund which actually keeps you in control now what i know is that a lot of our coin sutra trading community users uses this bybit sub account feature to test different strategies as you know that we teach about grid bot and dca bot and different automated bot trading strategy we do have a course about that also so instead of running this strategy on your main account which can become a little cumbersome. What you can do is you can actually have sub account for different strategy. You can transfer fund and then execute these strategies. In my understanding, it's a great idea that if you separate your investing and trading account, and if you have multiple trading strategies, it's a good idea to you know separate these different strategies so that you can easily calculate what is your overall pnl over a longer period of time without further delay let's go ahead let's learn everything about bybit sub account feature so very first thing if you have a kyc bybit account you can start using the sub account feature immediately you don't need to do kyc for your sub account now, what you need to understand that Bybit let you create three different sub account types, which is pretty amazing. And to get started, all you need to do is log into your Bybit account, click on your profile at the top, click on sub account feature. And I already have one account, but if you want to create another account, you click on create sub account here. Now, as I said, Bybit allows you to create three sub accounts. So the very first sub account is standard sub account. Then we have custom sub account. And then third one is custodial trading sub account. In most of the cases, you would be dealing with standard and custom sub account. To keep your life simple, let me help you understand the difference between these two. So in the standard sub account, you will not have a login, username and password. But with the custom sub account, you will be creating a username and password. And so that you want to give access to somebody else or you want to log in directly to your sub account, you can do that with the username and password. So in this case, let's create a custom sub account. Now here, there are two things you need to know. The account type that you'll be creating, you can create a unified trading account. This is a new feature added by Pybit. Not so new feature, but it helps you to optimize your entire asset so for example if you have funds on your margin account or futures account or on spot wallet bybit will start treating all of them as one so that if you're you know you need to add more margin instead of transferring fund you will be using your spot wallet fund as well this definitely adds some amount of risk but for the pro traders who want to maximize their overall asset this feature is very very needed so depending on where you are at, I would suggest if you're getting started, just use the standard feature. You can create a username. So let's give it coin sutra test and similarly add a password. So, and that's it. Now there's one thing you need to keep in mind that you can enable the account switch for your main account and sub account. You can do that. Or if you disable this, well, you would not be able to switch from main account to sub account, but you can always log into your sub account using this username and password. So I would rather suggest you keep this enabled. Now do remember you need this username and password only if you're planning to share it with somebody else. If not, you can simply cancel this, create a sub account, standard sub account. Okay. Select the standard account, give it a name, coin sutra test and for video guide and click on confirm so that's it your account has been created now we have this standard account right here now there are a few things you can do you can you can do an account switch by moving to this account but we can't do much thing there because there are no funds so the very first thing you would want to do is you want to transfer asset so you click on transfer assets here 
and then you can select from where from main account you can transfer asset to your test account so if you have some fund we can move it from here to here unfortunately there is no free fund that i could move right now but i hope you get an idea now if you actually have to move fund back from sub account to main account well you can do the same process just ensure that you see this name here this is the name of their sub account and this is the name of main account is your main account and you can transfer all the fund right now another very most common question that i've been asked is how do i create an api key for my sub account because you might be using a third party tool such as three commas bitsgap or trady or any other trading journal or trading tool then you would need api key now this could get a little confusing because when you are on this page you see there is an api management feature here and most likely you're going to click here but the problem is when you're creating a sub account api you don't go from here you click on sub account you click on api management here and then you can click on create new api key follow the steps of creating a new api key on bybit if you don't know that you can watch our earlier video where i've talked a lot about different features of bybit including how to create api key and then you can use this api key on any of the tool that you want now what i've seen is most of the people what they do is they create a sub account and then they create different api key and use that to run all this sub account from one trading terminal like three commas bits gap already or any other tool that you use so this covers everything about pybit sub account feature and if you have not used this definitely go and use it do know that like if you are a vip one two three four when you're using a sub account the trading fee that is paid by the sub account the rate would be same as your main account so if you already are a vip that means you are basically paying less by bit fee your sub account will use the same fee and also the trading volume generated by your sub account will be counted under the main account so that ways your you know you have more higher chances of increasing your vip level with that if you have any other question let me know in the comment section below if you like this video do like and subscribe to coin sutra channel as we are publishing some really awesome tutorial in the days to come with that see you in the next video bye bye this is harsh